What is going on people welcome back to another video on aj5 and in today's video guys we do have an update on aurora which has gone for a major increase in value in the last 24 to 48 hours pumping from just below 20 cents to near about hitting 30 cents guys so we're going to be going through why is it pumping so much and looking at what is next for aurora as you guys can see has pumped up over 30 percent in the last 24 hours itself and it is still ongoing so is it a crypto to be investing into right now is it too late or if you've already invested into it and are on a profit is it time to sell it or is it simply time to hold on to it so we'll be covering both buyers and sellers point of view and also looking at its prediction over the short term and the long term in 2024 looking at is this a crypto worth investing into but before i get into all of that stuff guys if you're new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet make sure to go down and smash that subscribe button as well as like the video as i am trying to hit a hundred thousand subscribers by the end of the year and if you guys can help me hit that target i will be doing a cryptocurrency giveaway which you guys can join by simply subscribing to the channel and for a bonus entry follow me on instagram link to that will be in the description box down below so we are currently looking at the candlestick pattern chart with the Fibonacci scale and as you guys can see we were resisting at the resistance level for about just about three weeks guys as you guys can see and we have finally broken out into the green zone and near about hitting the next resistance level here which is at around 30 cents 31 cents nearly guys but the whole point is that it has gone literally pumped up quite a bit but because of the major pump the crypto may be slightly overvalued and may be going through a price correction which i will be going through later on in the video so for now let's hide this and bring out the usual macd indicator to do some price prediction as i'm pretty sure that's what most of you guys are here for so at the top here we've got the purple line running across the chart giving us the average value of aurora which is here in purple at 21 cents and we can see the crypto is currently trading at a much higher value here in red at near about 29 cents meaning it's performing very well and much better than expected but again as i mentioned because of the huge difference between the two values here the crypto once again may be slightly overvalued so let's zoom in into the 30 minute chart for the short term traders and then i'll move on to the hourly daily and weekly chart for the long term investors like myself but before i do that guys just a little disclaimer as usual this is no financial advice i'm not a financial advisor anything i say is from my own prediction and my take on this crypto and any gains or losses you guys make i will not be responsible for so zooming into the 30 minute chart here we do have the blue and the orange line looking quite bullish heading towards a positive direction however they are looking a little bit too steep to be realistic reason they're looking so steep is because of the major increase that's taken place over the last 24 hours the graph thinks the crypto is going to keep pumping in that direction and at that pace over the next 12 to 14 hours which is not the case so essentially by midday to afternoon time I'm expecting the crypto to have dropped back down below 26 cents in value is where I'm expecting it to be trading at so potentially around 24 to 25 cents guys by the afternoon reason being is it has to go for a price correction which I'm expecting it to take place over the coming hours hitting more red candlesticks don't get me wrong over the next few hours it is likely to hit more green candles potentially hitting 30 cents before it then slowly starts to hit red candles dropping below 26 cents in value this is what my expectations are moving on to the hourly chart next couple of days what can we see here the blue and the orange line are still looking quite bullish heading towards a positive direction and again they are looking quite steep guys exact same reason as the previous chart so it is not as realistic as it seems so over the next seven to eight days by the end of next week i'm expecting aurora to have once again gone for an overall minimal drop in value this point i'm expecting it to have dropped below 24 cents guys potentially just over 22 cents in value is where i'm expecting the crypto to be trading at by the end of next week again i'm expecting it to drop down further because of the price correction and being overvalued so it is likely you are likely to see more red days from aurora over the coming week even though i'm expecting the crypto market to be moving towards the bullish direction for over the next week or two aurora has gone for a major increase in value that from the predictions that i have done it has to go for a price correction as i keep saying 
moving on to the daily chart over the next few weeks what can we see here so the blue line is still looking quite bullish and looking quite steep however the orange line is looking much more realistic heading upwards towards the bullish direction so over the next six to eight weeks guys early to mid august 2024 i'm expecting aurora to be trading at a higher value than where it is at the moment so after it goes through the price correction over the coming week or two it is likely to go through an overall increase in value in july and august potentially heading over 40 cents in value is where i'm expecting the crypto to be trading at in august again i'm also expecting bitcoin to be hitting a new all-time high in late july early august which should have a positive impact on the crypto market which of course involves aurora as well so heading over 40 cents in value is what my expectations are at the moment however if there are any major changes to this for example if i'm expecting it to pump or drop or anything like that i will let you guys know as soon as possible so make sure you guys stay subscribed and turn on the bell notifications to get notified every time i upload so let's bring back the fibonacci scale so as you guys can see we are currently trading in the green zone and yes it is getting closer to the resistance level so what i'm essentially expecting over the coming weeks is for aurora to be dropping down further down into the green zone getting closer back into the red zone is what i'm expecting at the moment but over the long term i'm expecting it to head up into the blue zone heading over 40 cents in value over the next two to three months so let's get rid of the fibonacci scale and head into the coin market cap website here we can see the trading volume has gone through an increase 250 percent guys making over seven million dollars in trading which is quite a huge increase in trading reason is quite obvious is because of the major pump that's taken place over the week it has gone up 54 percent and over the month just about 14 percent because for majority of the month especially in may the crypto was hitting red candles dropping down in value all up until a few days ago where it started to recover and currently pumping up in value i've seen a lot of comments saying aurora is potentially likely to hit the dollar mark by the end of the year which i kind of disagree with because for it to hit the dollar mark it will need to go for a major increase in value which i'm not expecting from aurora at the moment but about 50 cents towards the end of the year is reasonable but a dollar mark is a little bit over the top for myself but let me know what your thoughts on that and how high can aurora go in 2024 comment down below as i'm very intrigued to see how many of you guys are bullish and how many of you guys are bearish on this crypto and on that note i'm going to end the video here guys i just want to say a massive thank you to every single one of you who have been subscribing liking commenting and just supporting the channel in any way or form and especially all the subscribers out there thank you guys so much as it helps me out a lot and means a lot to me as i am trying to hit 100k by the end of the year and at the end of the day guys it's free to subscribe so why don't you go down and smash that subscribe button and like the video and i catch all of you guys in my next crypto update which should hopefully be later on today or tomorrow until then take care and peace